He said, no, I have not. He asked me if I heard Ryan Garcia's new song. I seen that he dropped one and I decided never to pay Ryan Garcia any attention in any way, shape, or form. Fuck Ryan Garcia. Ryan Garcia could eat a bag of dicks. He a bitch ass nigga. And it's crazy. I was hoping for him to win the fight. And then if I after him to win the fight to go, oh, I was trolling with all the other stuff. I made it up. I made it up. All the exposing Hollywood and the kids that have been hurt. Me going out and defending them. Me saying I'm speaking for those people that are not empowered, who have been destroyed and manipulated and taken advantage of from Hollywood or just people that are in power or gatekeepers. Him saying all of that was a troll to sell tickets for his fights. Fuck him. You bitch. I don't want to hear his rap song. He can eat a bag of dicks. Once again, I want to hear his rap song. Fuck him. I don't. Okay, you're not hearing me. But all right, whatever. Love the song if you want to. I don't give a fuck if the song's good. <laughs> I don't care. You eat a dick. Like, I, I guess people think it's a joke or you don't take YouTubers seriously when they say this. And I can't blame you because I might be one of the few that actually take it serious. But I am against the system. I actually am against the gatekeepers. I am against the people who actually do want to take advantage of the motherfuckers just so they could be disgusted, nasty, demonic people. I do believe all these secret meetings are happening. I do believe in humiliation rituals as well as other ones that are taking place. I am a firm believer. And I'm also a firm believer of people not taking advantage of people like me in order to sell something. Hence Tom McDonald, Ryan Garcia. I don't fucking like them. Because what about the people who are actually being hurt? Shit, look at me actually getting gate kept. Look at the bigger people actually gatekeeping me. And I'm supposed to take somebody joking with that, like, ha let's go listen to this song. Fuck them. If I was to listen to this song, it would just be me shitting on them the whole time. I don't give a fuck how good this song is. Like, I just don't respect that shit. Um, but that's me. I don't expect um, everyone to be on that. But I'm 100%. I'm not like these fake YouTubers that say I'm about the system just for views because I don't get views. I actually lose views and lose subscribers for standing on my principles. So no, fuck Ryan Garcia. I don't want to hear that song. I don't even care if he gets me views at this point. I'm nigga. I'm good. <laughs> I'm straight. Facts, uh, just let it roll off, bro. Keep that. I'm on big facts. Oh, with new music and patient. I think Ronnie is pretty dope. He has a lot of talent. I did a documentary on him, man. Definitely a rebel. He had to say that. Y'all say he had to say that? You're going to have to elaborate on that. <laughs> I'm not with that bullshit. You had to say, nah, nigga. Nah. you going to stand for the truth or not. It ain't no had to. I guess BXB's boy would have been deleted from the video game because not lying for nothing. Now, can you see me come over here saying all that hit keeping talk was fake? I'm drugged, nigga. <laughs> it's AI. Yeah. He's a plant. Yeah, I believe it. Stay the most loops. Keep my circle small, so I miss a lot. Yeah, I peeped it. I, I would stay close to topics like that because I thought he was serious and I wanted to make sure he was going to be okay. I would have been the first one talking about it if anybody tried to do him dirty. They wouldn't pay him. You know the game. That's nasty.